winning, winning has always been a part of your DNA. Only winning. High school champion, college, right. McDonald's All-American, uh -huh. and Michigan State. Mm -hmm. So this is the question I got to ask. Mm -hmm. How many bags were thrown at you when you went to Michigan State? Uh, <laughs> a lot of people offered me money. I knew it. I knew it. What kind of bags, though? Oh, they were big bags. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, you know what? My father, he always gave me life lessons. So here I am. Uh, he said, we're not taking no money. Mm. And I said, okay, cool. So I decided to stay close to home because my mother and father and all my brothers and sisters had never missed none of my games, and I wanted that to continue. Right. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'm a mama's boy, so I love my mother, so I wasn't giving up her fried chicken and none of yeah, the other stuff <laughs> she brought to the table, them hugs and everything, right? So um, my freshman year, we win the Big Ten, go all the way to the final eight. Kentucky beat us. Kansas City had the number one pick, so they called me and said, hey, we want to draft you number one. That's the Kansas City Kings, right? Yeah, they were Kansas City Kings at Good that move. time. So I flew down, met with the dude named Joel Ackerson, the general manager, and he said, hey, I'm going to give you a six-year deal, 200000 a year. So, you know, I got excited. I, I've been broke my whole life. Yeah, I'm like, oh, man, this is great. Ching, ching. And so um, I, got, I jumped up said, oh, I think that's good. My father grabbed me. <laughs> and he pulled me, drug me outside the door. He said, hold on, we'll be right back. He said, you've been broke for 18 years. You, you can be broke one more year. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're not going to one Kansas more year, Lord. <laughs> <laughs> I, I said, yes, sir. <laughs> yeah. So I, you're going back to school. Oof. So I went back to school. Yeah. And I'm glad I did because I finished what I came to college for, which was to win the national championship and uh, mm -hmm. play against Larry Bird in that yeah. unbelievable final. The most watched uh, college championship ever. To That's this right. Day. To, to this, this day. day, still the most watched. And uh, so to be linked with this dude who, you know, you said, man. First, when I first met him, I said, all right, I'm going to see this dude, this white cat can really go like Because the verdict said, is right? always out on white boys yeah, like a hoop, yeah, with all yeah, due respect. Yeah, 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 it's, it's always it's, out. It's, it's respect. This yeah. ain't nothing yeah. bad. So I said, let me see what he can do. But Larry had something that most oh, white boys man. don't have. Yeah, just man. say that. Just keep it real. Man, yeah, Larry, 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 Larry was different he, now. He Larry was different now. He had a little bit of nigger. Yeah, he was different now. He was different now. Larry was different now. That boy, <laughs> he could play, man. He turned it out. We, we played on, on a team in college uh, in a tournament together. This is the first time I ever sat on the bench. Him and I were on the bench. Mm. And um, we were like, the guys in front of us wasn't better than us, but Kentucky head coach was coaching the team, so he started three guys from Kentucky. <laughs> so we said, okay. But when we got in the game, we turned it out. <laughs> but I saw this dude eat Jack Givens up. He was player of the year that year. Kentucky, right? Yeah, from Kentucky. And Larry Bird was just slicing and dicing him. And I said, <laughs> oh, I called home. I said, it's true about this boy. <laughs> <laughs> I was calling everybody, this dude can play. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so that was my first time seeing him, and then to be out on the court with him in college for that national championship game, and then, of course, what happened in the NBA. But I would say that uh, we got a chance to change the league. Yeah. You know what? What a blessing it was. He ended up in Boston, and then I ended up out here. My personality was L.A., Hollywood. Right his personality was Boston, right. and it worked for the whole league, you right. know, so everything was good.